Local Weather Authority. Good afternoon and welcome back. Well, a gorgeous day in the Wabash Valley, but it is going to be a hot one. This is South 3rd Street in Terre Haute on the Graper Post Buildings camera. The sun is shining a couple of clouds this afternoon, but it is going to be nice and dry as it is right now on the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar. Now for our current temps, we are along the 80s right now. 84 in Danville, 84 also in Bloomington. 86 in Vincennes. That heat index right now hitting over 90 for quite a few of us. And here's an idea on what it is going to feel like throughout the next 48 hours. So later this afternoon, few of us are going to hit the upper 90s. Again, this is repeating for tomorrow as well. This is our heat index of what it's going to feel like, not the actual temps. But as you can see tomorrow, further down south, it is going to feel around 98. So we are approaching that 100 mark just underneath it. So it is going to be hot and muggy the next couple of days, but on Friday we are going to start cooling back down. It's still warm, but we are going to be in the lower 80s. Now, winds picking up just a little in a couple of areas. There is a slight breeze throughout the afternoon at about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Wind, though, not a big factor, and here is activity on the satellite radar. This is over the last six hours. Here's a closer look on in. It has been quite clear in our neck of the woods, just a couple of clouds moving on through as the same for the rest rest of the day. So mostly sunny right now. Couple of clouds later today as we do become partly sunny. It's going to be partly cloudy for tonight. Nice and dry. And then tomorrow, partly sunny. Could see a couple of isolated showers. However, for the most of us, we are going to be dry for tomorrow as well. In fact, the next couple of days. For today, those highs, the lower 90s, again, that heat index, upper 90s for quite a few of us, partly sunny. It is going to be a hot and humid one. For tonight, it is going to be muggy yet again. That low is about 70. And for tomorrow, partly sunny, the lower 90s, that heat index just under 100 for quite a few of us. Could see a couple of isolated showers, but again, not all of us affected. In fact, a majority of us are going to stay dry for tomorrow as well. And here's a preview of the next seven days. Our temps are decreasing again on Friday at 81. So a nice little cool down to kick off the weekend. And right now the weekend looking quite nice. You know, I've not been outside since I got to work this morning. I'm thinking I don't want to go outside. <laughs> I know it's going to be very, very muggy. Unfortunately, that fall weather is gone. Yeah. So one of the North Carolina communities that were hit.